Hi, welcome to the Understanding Neuropsychology, Cognition Law, and Open Science group. I'm Dr. Baldessari. We call ourselves the Unclog Lab, those of us who are all the way in. Uh, we have, uh, I have a number of different interests that uh, I investigate through the lab. Uh, they're all kind of laid out in that, uh, in that big long acronym, but I can characterize it in three different kind of main roads that I like to go down. The first is eyewitness identification. Uh, in particular, I'm, I've most recently been interested in methods of predicting accuracy in eyewitness identification. So we've worked on a couple of different tests that, if applied, could give a practitioner in the real world, say a police officer, an idea for whether they're likely to uh, have a good or bad witness on their hands, uh, and then thinking about whether they can make that judgment themselves is a whole uh, other interesting research question. Uh, I've done some other work thinking a little bit more deeply about the uh, some of the basic questions of the eyewitness identification literature because it is an important literature that's had a, a really large effect on actual public practice. Uh, in the way that a lot of psychology hasn't seen such direct and, and uh, immediate applications. So it's important that we get these questions right. And so I, I want to think about some of the assumptions we make in our literature uh, and try, our, try, try again to tr make sure we're establishing really solidly evidence-based best practices for uh, the people who apply our work, but also for ourselves. So making sure that materials development and methodological rigor is uh, really carefully done within uh, the psych and law area, particularly within the eyewitnessing area. And then these, these, these skills that I've developed in this research I do, could, you could sort of zoom out and call it applied memory research. And that applies also to learning in the classroom, which is another big interest of mine, uh, particularly student memory in the classroom and student how that links to student motivation and uh, all kinds of other, other research factors there. So those are kind of the three big roads. We have uh, predicting eyewitness accuracy or just eyewitness accuracy in general, uh, the sort of navel gazy uh, methodological thoughts about eyewitness identification and psych and law research, and then uh, applying um, what we know about memory to student learning in the classroom. I'm always open to other things too. I've done work in uh, uh, co-witnessing and false memory um, uh, and EEG, uh, and so there's, there's all kinds of things that could potentially interest me. So if you're a student, you have an idea that sounds even somewhat close to any of these, get in touch. I'd be happy to chat uh, about the possibility of working together. It's nice to meet you. Hope to see you in the Unclog Lab.